this is Nani. Uh, my channel's name is My Joyful Life with My Dollies. And I still go by booties and bonnets also, but either one. And um, I just came in from um, helping my husband paint our house. We're painting the outside of it, and it's a lot of work, but it's well worth it. Um, we've lived in this house about 30 years, 31, and um, we have kind of uh, cedar, um, cedar uh, siding or... Uh, so it takes a while. We don't have regular siding, but um, you know it might. It's gonna take us a couple weeks or uh, to get it done, depending on the weather. And tomorrow we're supposed to get some rain. Finally, we've had very dry weather here, um, here in Wisconsin, and so we're ready for the rain. The grass is looking a little brown, and I'm having to go out and water the plants. And um, so anyway, I've, I've got two of my lovely dollies here. This is uh, little Elena, and she's the uh, Elliot sculpt. I just changed her into this adorable little um, romper, and it's got like a flamingo um, on the side, like a little pink, pink flamingo and some little flowers. And... She is one of my older dollies. Um, I painted her maybe in 2020, so I, she's probably three years old now, or three and a half. And um, she's sculpted by Michelle Fagan, and uh, I just love her little face. She, I love her little expression and her blue eyes. I thought the blue eyes looked so pretty with her blonde hair. And, um, and she's got very big hands. So that she can play with things. She likes playing a lot. And, um, you know, if you have teethers or rattles or um, any kind of toy like that, she loves those kind of toys. And she wears probably three to six month clothes. But, um, but yeah, she wanted to come and be on the video today. And, uh, yeah, I, I just love this little romper with the little uh, green and white squares and it just looks very summery doesn't it little Elena yeah it looks you look very summery so and then uh, we have little Emma and I haven't shown her in a while I'll, I'll put Emma's bottle over here but little Emma she's the um, Emma's the Leah sculpt and she's just a little sweetheart um, and she was, uh, her sculptor is um, Sandra White. And I don't know, I haven't seen this sculpt very often. Uh, she's an older baby. And I think I bought her through Bountiful Baby when I first started. And I just love that little face. Don't you love that little face? And I, it was my first attempt at rooting hair. And, she, and I think I did a beautiful, uh, wonderful job. You know, it takes practice. But um, she, it's a very soft, kind of soft mohair, and I, I used air dry paints on her. And you know, um, Genesis heat paints are great, but I, I still love my air dry paints. And I've had these dollies at least five or six years, and the paint, I mean, and they're just staying as um, um, true to color as when I first painted them. And I think the trick is to varnish them well and keep them away from the sun because the sunlight can really fade uh, the paint on babies and these reborns. So just be careful if you have a um, reborn dolly. Don't leave, leave them out in a hot car or out in the sun too long. Um, so anyway, I, I just adore this little girl. And she's wearing the cutest little romper. And it's got a little mouse, and as you can see, oops, I'll show you the little mouse, how cute she is. And it's a little mouse with a little flower. Isn't that cute? And I bought this um, little summer outfit maybe last summer. Uh, I just fell in love with it. I think it's from Carter's. And, um, you know, Carter's has really 
cute clothes. You just have to keep looking. And every summer after, after in August, when everything goes on clearance or September, that's a great time to buy summery clothes for our dollies for the next season so or for the next summer. But, but she is a little precious, isn't she? And um, I just love her very dainty hands. She's got very dainty fingers. And she's got very tiny little toes. I'll show you her little toes. They're just so tiny and small. And I like my dollies with a little more modeling. So, uh, yeah, she's got quite a bit of modeling, which is what I like. And she's just as adorable as can be. Aren't you, little Emma? So, we'll put little Emma over here. I'm not going to change any dollies today. Um, but um, I know some of you are going to be going to the doll show coming up. And I am so excited for you. Uh, the one in um, North Carolina, uh, Dolls of the World. And I wish I could come, but I know you're all going to have a wonderful time. And I'm hoping it's on my bucket list that I'll be going to a doll show uh, soon or in the next couple years. Uh, whether it's a Rose Doll Show or some other doll show. Um, I'm kind of aiming for the Rose Doll Show, so we'll see. I know it wasn't on this year, and um, and I've got a lot going on. Uh, painting the house. My husband's retired now, so, uh, so now is a good time to get some of those household things done. House things done, and... Um, so anyway, so since we're wishing for win for a rain tomorrow, aren't we, little Elena? She says, "Oh, I need some rain. It's just been so dry." We're gonna sing a couple little songs about rain because we want the rain to come. And so let's see what songs I found. This is the We Sing Children's Songs and Finger Plays, and I had this one. Our kids were little, and I always used to love singing, doing finger plays with them, or sing, singing like little children's um, nursery rhymes, and I just love that so much. So, but I found one about rain. What oh, was the rain, rain one? And some of you might be familiar with these songs. And um, oh, I've got a little blue bear here who's gonna join me, little teddy bear. Yeah, he's a soft, plushy little bear. And um, yeah, it says my first teddy on it. So I love how plushy he is. But um, so the first song that I saw was Rain, Rain, Go Away. And if you want to sing along or have your dollies join in, you can do that. So we're all going to sing, right, Elena? Sing our nursery rhymes. So let's start. Let's say. Rain, rain, go away, come again another day. Little Betty wants to play. Rain, rain, go away. Yes, we need some rain, don't we, Elena and Emma? We need some rain. Emma sound asleep over there, but we could sure use it. Um, and then... There's, this one's called There is Thunder, and it goes to the tune of Are You Sleeping? And of course, thunder isn't one of my favorite things about rain, but you know, when sometimes thunder is a good thing because then it shows that it's really raining outside. And so let's sing along together. It's called There is Thunder. So let's sing. And there is thunder, there is thunder, hear it roar, hear it roar, pitter patter raindrops, pitter pitter, pitter patter raindrops, I'm all wet, I'm all wet. And then um, you can do that with if you have little kids at home, they love their nur the nursery rhymes. And the next one is called um, uh, let's see here. Okay, we can do a um, 
It's raining. Okay, this one we all know, don't we? We know this song. It's called It's Raining. It's raining, it's pouring. The old man is snoring. He went to bed and bumped his head and couldn't get up in the morning. Rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. Little Elena wants to play. Yay! Right, little Elena? So, yeah, I just thought I'd join. I, we'd sing these together. And I hope you're all getting good weather where you're at. And if it's hot and sunny, that you'll get rain soon too for, to make all the plants grow, help the plants grow and um, the veggies grow. And, oh, I wanted to show you something else I have here. I haven't taken this background out lately, and I, I just fell in love with that. I bought it a while back, and I thought I'd show you. And it's got little owls. Oops, we'll bring little Elena over here. Right, little Elena. But as you can see, we have a little owl on the tree branch, and there's like a ladybug. And lots of pretty flowers, uh, bright colors like bl uh, blue and yellow with pink. And the leaves are really green, like bright green. And I love things that are colorful. And if you see the borders, how colorful it is. Um, yeah, I just love these backgrounds. So I thought they'd be kind of fun to show with my dollies. Right, little Elena? Yes. Don't wake up your sister. And I'll see, I'll move little, um, I'll be very careful, and we'll move um, little Emma over here. Oh, little Emma, and then you can see what's behind her. And she, there's a, let's see, what do we see? A little bird on a branch, and um, yeah, looks like a very happy little bird. A little blue one, and then there's another flower here, and... Um, the sun must be up there someplace. I'm not sure. It's hiding up in the sky. But I thought I'd show you this because I love these backdrops and it's from Bright Starts. So babies, I guess as they get, get older, they finally get to see color. Um, when they're first born, it's all black and white is what they like. And then as they get a little bigger, then they love bright colors. So I just wanted to show you that. And I'm wishing you all a wonderful weekend, and thank you so much for joining me. And I'll be back again soon. And, uh, yeah, like I said, we've been very busy painting, but it's good that I'm motivated to paint, and the weather's been good for it. So, but I want to thank you all for coming, and I uh, please subscribe to my channel, and... Um, I want to send you all big hugs and uh, that if you're not feeling well, I hope you feel better and soon. And I love you all. Take care. Bye-bye.